right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. Check it out. Right off the bat, Mike Wong has been going around the streams and getting people's feedback on the game. So always watch what you say. Don't be too harsh. Don't be too critical. And do not, for the love of goodness, say anything that you can't back up. And if you don't have a good idea, just don't even say anything at all, man. Don't just bash the game and talk about, you know, this, this, and that when you don't have a good idea. Anyway, the biggest thing that came from today, uh, we got patch 1.03. Patch 1.03, we don't know what it did do. Um, but Mike Wong said that one thing that it definitely did was it changed dribbling. And more or less, he put the escape dribble. He and Pope were having a, uh, having a conversation on Twitter the other day. And uh, he said that what it would do is it was going to change the escape dribble to to the R R two and down rather or down on the right stick rather than down on the left stick. That is something that was hard to uh, to convert. But I think it's going to really make the make the dribbling the two stick dribbling uh, pretty nice. I think the two stick dribbling has been a dub so far. If you think it's been a W so far, let me know down in the comments. If you think it's been an L so far, let me know down in the comments. One thing I want to know is this. Oh, yeah, they also changed shooting. He said there was a slight buff for stretch bigs, a slight buff for uh, for full whites, more or less, and then a slight nerf for uh, fading shots and a slight nerf for badly timed shots. Somebody, I guess, had found a glitch where if you time a shot badly, it would always go in. I, I, I have no clue what that is. What I want to know is this. You guys saw me blue screen simulator yesterday. Did it fix this? Oh! <gasps> Ah! Yo, every time I pull my phone out yesterday, blue screen, baby. Yeah, I, that's how it was, man. I was getting a straight blue screen every time. So what we're going to do, let, let, we're going to test our luck, man. Let's zoom out a little bit. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Let me know what game that's from. I got you something now. I can pull my phone out. Let's see if I can go to my court, and we're going to test out this dribbling and all that good stuff. I'll explain all that to you. Hey, what's going on, uh, big dog? I don't even know what his name is because I never listen to it uh, when that happens. But like I said, we don't have any official patch notes uh, at, at the moment. We just have little patch details and all of that. But Mike Wong is tweeting. And uh, like, like I said, I couldn't go to my court. I couldn't really do anything yesterday. You guys saw me. I was really upset. But uh, let's see. Here we go. We've, we've got some official patch notes here, and I'm gonna I'm gonna walk you guys through them really quickly. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna start from the beginning, and then uh, we'll go down to the bottom. I couldn't even get in my court yesterday. It was insane. Somebody had let me know. They was like, "Yo, if you can't get in my court, you just gotta spam uh spam X when you walk in, and then it'll just put you into the into the deal." But let's talk about stuff. Let, all right, so let's look at dribbling first. So right trigger and down. That's just, that's, that's right trigger and down. Okay, so that's the between the legs or, or that escape dribble. And then that one is that escape dribble. So I could do this. I could do this and then, can I do this and then cross over? No, he's gonna make me do that. So can I do this? Hesitating crossover? Yeah, that's still, that's still kind of weak. I wish my guy could dribble faster, man. It just sucks that he can't really, he can't really dribble dribble, but, uh. I mean, I can do, you know, I can do a little, little something here, a little something there. But the main thing that I need to try to do is just get, get into an animation, and then, you know, in, in just do the quick, uh, what you call it, quick first step. So I just need to hit something like this and and do stuff like that. That's what I'm gonna have to do with him. So my thing with this guy is just gonna be change the direction. You can do the, uh, the zuli zuli, the zuli zuli move which is the behind the back, do that, All right, and come back behind the back, or you can... Yo, have y'all noticed that dribbling online is just just awful? It just feels like you don't have full control of your guy. I don't know. Maybe I'm the only one that has that. So you got to do... To do the behind the back, you got to go diagonal now, and you got you to gotta really go diagonal well. I don't know why it appears to be on... Uh, it's like it's on... It's, not, it's like I'm on camera relative in here or something like that. I don't know why. But, hey, it is what it is. But, uh, yo, I can come in my my court now. That's a plus. Let's see if I'm on absolute. Because I, I, I'm always on absolute. 
Okay, so they changed this stuff up right here. This is definitely different. None of this was was tabbed out or any of that stuff. Not like all this was blank on mine. So uh, let me see. Let me see. Shot meter. That should be off. Uh, hold up. My shot shot sound. My bad. Shot sand layups. Shot meter should be off. Um, hopefully they got that to that can stick. I gotta turn off all the 2K beats. I don't care about any of those. Um, did they mess up my passing? Let's see if they reset our settings on passing and stuff. And passing targeting, they sure did. This needs to go back to 70. Uh, yeah, and then open this needs to be, to go to Hades. H-E double hockey sticks. And then uh, what's the last thing I'm supposed to do? Oh yeah, I gotta take control of the settings to see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pro stick orientation is absolute. So I don't know why. I don't know, man. Dribbling is just weird this year, even regardless of what it is. But anyway, patch notes coming right up. Uh, with today's with today's update, R2 and uh, R2, which is whatever, uh, right trigger, and the right stick down is a step back escape, and then for the behind the back escape, that's uh, right stick and uh, that's right trigger and left stick down. So that's for cool. Uh, fixed speed and stamina issues. So we're gonna see how that is when we stream tonight. Multiplayer improvements. Fixed crashing issues. Hallelujah. We got that. That's that's what I need, bro. Y'all got I caught so many blue screens last night, bro. I was sad. Like somebody was like, Jay, I haven't seen you like this since raising with Randall. I'm like, bro, I never saw myself like this. Added stability improvements, various minor fixes, which means they fixed every VC and uh bad this that, that was out there. Uh let me see. If you're if you're getting the error message that reads use a data file has been corrupted and is uh and is unloadable. The error, let me see, the error message appears after the reserve space uh, was cleared. Yeah, that's cool. Hopefully, I stop crashing like when I play a game in the park or whatever, too. Our uh, reserve space data will be re-downloaded, blah, blah, blah. We don't care about that. I'm on PlayStation, so, you know. So, clear your reserve space if, if you're having uh, crashing issues. And uh, to ensure that the, that the data is downloaded correctly, please do the following steps. Y'all know how to clear, you, you know how to clear your reserve space. And then if you're on PlayStation 4, you can leave your console in rest mode while the data is downloading or uh, whatever. We, we cool on that. And then uh, after a few hours, you'll, you'll receive a notification in yellow, in yellow font at the bottom left corner of your screen. Yeah, yeah we're not going to do all of that, man. Look, all I'm telling you is hopefully I'm not crashing out of games anymore. And let's see if I can do the Zuli, the Zuli, Zuli. I, I, pulled, I pulled the trigger. That was on me. Um, uh, hopefully I'm not crashing out of games anymore. I was able to... Um, I'm able to get into my court, so that's enough. I gotta get myself another uh, another um, controller, man, because this controller right here, it's like, it's like I I, I don't know. It's like it'll it, it's 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 like the left trigger is stuck going forward. You see, I'm not pressing anything, but it does, it makes it extremely hard to play the game, especially when it thinks that I'm taking moving shots when I'm not taking moving shots. Or I'm trying to do a dribble move and show y'all how to do something, and then I can't do it because see he wants to do that. He's acting like he's acting like I'm doing left trigger and uh and forward or whatever. But hey, it is what it is, man. I'll I, that's that's a me problem. Anyway, smoothest jump shot in the game. If you want to know what this jump shot is, let me know. Is I changed it up from the Paul George and I, bro, I am greening with this. And like they said, if you if you're using no shot meter, which I'm gonna drop a video on how to how to up your jump shot percentage uh, a little bit later, but if you're using the shot meter, you can you can actually just stop using the shot meter if you know your jump shot and you're good to go. I haven't shot this since last night, but you know, if he kicks out, it's going in, and then most of the time it's green, so I don't even have to worry about that. Get hot zone hunter. Get all your badges, and you'll shoot a whole lot better, man. But anyway, I got to get up out of here, man. I don't want to make this video 10 minutes. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, we're going to catch y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! If y'all guys want the video on how to become a better shooter in this game, all the little tips and tricks that I have, just let me know. I got you, and I'm gone. Peace! Oh, man. Let me see if I can do this Zuli Zuli one more time, man. See. It won't, it won't, it won't let me do it. Like, and then like the other thing is, let's see if they fix this right here. I'm sorry. Nope. That's still not fixed either where, where you can do like reverse. If anybody know how to do the reverse dunk, man, let me know. I can't do it. I can do the reverse layups. Like I can do reverse layups all day, but he will not do 
the baseline reverse. He won't do baseline reverse off one, uh, off two, and I don't know what it is that I'm doing wrong. I don't know if I'm just not close enough to the rim or what, but for whatever reason, it, it's just not working for me. And I think what it might be is it might be the, the, my left stick being broke or whatever, but hey, we'll see. Let me show y'all exactly what I'm talking about when I'm talking about my left stick being broke. Hold on one second. Like I said, I don't know why it's like that, but I, yeah, sometimes if I do that, it'll do. Okay, so now I might be now I might be able to do the thing now. So, Cause what we want to do is behind the back, man. Whatever, man. This thing here is killing me. Like it'll let me do it one time. Hey, that might be that might be just as good. Maybe I just can't do it no more. But uh, I'm gonna catch y'all later, man. Y'all take it easy. Peace.